Hi everyone, welcome back to this series. Um, I apologize for the the break from last video. I didn't you know I've exceeded the limit of my recording. All right, so um, if you are still here to subscribe to this channel, um, please do. So um, let's get back to where we drop off. We're discussing ashes. So um, now. I was actually I was actually talking through the video, not knowing that I've exited limit. So you see, I have all these examples here set. So let me just clear this now. Um, so to get to get the ashes that we have stored, you can actually do h get chat one message. Yeah, chat one message or each gets chat two message or we can use each get all chat one. If we're making if we're making a call to this command from um, PHP from from PHP from Laravel, it's going to be turn all this as a list of um, array to us, so to be very very easy to to work with. So um. Next um data set we are going to um data type we're going to discuss. I keep saying data set, I apologize. Is um stored set. Stored set are very very fantastic. It's a very fantastic um data type. So stored stored set they are very similar to sets, except that um, every member of a stored set is associated with a score. That is that that, that is used in in order to sort the um, the set right from the smallest to the greatest score. So um think of um the chart that we that we just had now, like the chart example just we just have now, chart between two users. Now um there is going to be a first chart that was sent and then a second chart and then a third chart. So um in sort of sets we can represent them in sort of sets where the score is a time timestamp of when each chart was sent and then the value is the ID of the um charts of the charts that is being represented in the map. So it's easy for us to just look through a sort of set and then it's going to return the the uh, the most recent to us um, like in the order of the most recent to the um, latest right to us and then um, we can just using the ID we can fetch the result from the hash map. So you are going to see this example while we are building uh, our e-commerce. So now let's let's do a practical example. So say um like we said they are very similar to 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 a set. So let's say the same thing as so they, uh, as a set, a set that um it has a score for arranging it and then you can score for this from the smaller to the greater. So the commands are very similar. For set we have S S add for solid set we have Z add. Z add. So let's call it um charts between user one and then user two. Right, so um let's be practical time. Okay, so PHP time. So let's say the first one that goes in is this time. This is the score and the member is the ID of our charts. Next Let's do next time. So what's what's next time? This thing has a timestamp and the time in milliseconds. Second time. And then the ID is let's say two. Like that. Right. So if we do Z range. This is very long, so I'll just copy. I'll just type in charts between user one user 2 0 to minus 1 there is a mistake I've made user, user 1 and user 2 user 1 and user 1 yeah that's it see it returns 1 to in that order but then um, that's because that was, it's, it's not it's not ordering it by the by the value let me show you what, what, what I mean by that see is it that let me do this now Three. And let me check the next time. Copy that. Use as a score. 
Mm, let me do a message. Let me do message three. Let me do message zero. Just to, just to show an example that it's not let me back to this time. So right. So again, let me do this. Let me make it early. Right, message three. See, message three goes up. So what I'm just trying to try to show you is um, it's not actually really arranging by the way I entered it. It's like ordering it by the timestamp. So message three goes up because the scoring, which is like timestamp I use, is like much earlier than the rest. Everybody is like one five. I used one four just to show an example, right? So you can return its cause. Right, it shows the score. So you see, three goes fair because the score is like it comes out fair because the score is lower, and then it goes down like it's going ascending, ascending order. So that's that with them. Um, we did our types that we are discussing. So we've been able to discuss um, string. We've been able to discuss string sets, hashes, and then um, sort of sets. So um, in our next video, we are going to start discussing on um, how to build a simple e-commerce app using um Laravel and Redis and from what we've learned now we've learned the data type that are available. So in next video we are going to actually be um drawing out a, a DB schema like a DB schema to explain to, to, to map out how um our database for storing the products and tags for our simple e-commerce should be stored. So um until the next video, please subscribe to my channel.